Yo, what is going on guys? It's Hatchets here and today we're going to be installing a NVIDIA GTX 1050 Ti from EVGA, I'm pretty sure it's a super clocked 4 gigabyte version. So we're going to get right into this. And guys, I apologize if I don't have a good camera angle right now. The lighting is really bad because the sun is about to set. So it's sitting really low and shining through my windows. But basically we're going to do a little unboxing of this. So guys, we're just going to start off by taking the case cover off. It's not too complicated, but I can show you if you really would like me to. So I have this piece of crap PC right now, and I hope this works in it, but I'm not going to be too disappointed if it doesn't, because I'm going to keep that for the PC I'm going to make over the summer. It'll probably be my second graphics card if I am to do that. So let's just take this out right now. make sure I touch my case with both hands before I open this thing up so I don't give it any static charge. My PC is really easy to open. I just take the case off like that, flip this off. Flip that off, that side. Then I unscrew this. So guys, unfortunately I have a really shitty camera stand right now. If I tilt it forward, my camera will just fall. So this is basically the inside of my camera. I'm going to be taking this out right there and putting the better graphics card in. And this is all you know. Like You don't need to know much about that. You don't need to mess with any of this to change your graphics card. Right now I have a GT730 and I'm going to be upgrading that to the GTX 1050 Ti. So guys, I'm gonna open up the box right now. Make sure to keep this just in case. I'm also probably gonna use the static bag um, for my other graphics card. Comes in a tiny box. So I think this right here has my driver installed. This yeah, right here. Okay. This is like a manual, and here's the actual graphics card. Touch my box one more time. And I'm going to enter it without the uh, electrostatic safety equipment. There it is. Quite bigger than my last graphics card. Still compact. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna make sure not to touch the bottom because I can screw it up. So let's bring this over here. Let me touch my case one more time. I'll put that down right there. And I need to take off the plastic because I read online somewhere that that will screw it up if you forget to take that off. So there it is guys, that's what it looks like all together. And now let me pull out my old graphics card. Okay, so I'm gonna pull this up. And just hopefully lift this thing out. Here's the old one guys, the GT730. Great card for the price, how big it is. Guys, I got the uh, second port out as required by the card. Ooh, I don't know if this is gonna fit. Here goes nothing. Really tight fit. So guys, the card did end up fitting. That's what it looks like in. It's a really compact card, so I have probably one of the smallest computer cases there are out on the market right now. It's a micro ATX mini tower, so you should probably be able to fit whatever you want in there. 
as regards to the 1050 Ti. I thought for a second, oh no, this is not going to fit. I'm going to have to wait till my uh, PC build, but it fit perfectly. That'll do it for the installation video. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.